But tonight, take a moment and think about those people in the community who are passionate. Those individuals who do something not just because it's a job, but because it's in their soul. Over the next four weeks, we're going to introduce you to four people right here in Northeast Wisconsin making a difference day in and day out because it's what they're supposed to do. Tonight, if you've ever walked around downtown De Pere, there's a chance you've seen the art of Andrew Liskins, his vibrant murals turning buildings into landmarks. Local Fire's Aaron Taylor spoke to Andrew about why there is uh, more than just a hobby to this. It's what he's supposed to do. Andrew Linskin's window on the world is a little bit different. I looked at it and I saw an elephant right away, the downspout being the trunk, and I thought it would be kind of a clever little uh, think to when it rains, the you know, water would come out of the trunk. This is just one of the many murals he's been commissioned to paint in downtown De Pere. So like in a gallery setting, right, like in a white wall gallery, which we do not have a lot of here, um, something happens when you walk into that space where the art is allowed to kind of be its own thing, right? Um, this is similar to that. Um, but it doesn't have all of the restrictions that a gallery would have. Linskin's artwork can sometimes be seen on display in galleries, but on these walls, it reaches a much broader audience. Anybody can walk by. People often walk by and start conversations with you when you're making it kind of thing. It's just a different medium um, that reaches a large audience, and I was really drawn to that. There's one city in particular he's been drawn to create in. It appears definitely been the place uh, that I've been given the most opportunity. Andrew's murals are a way for him to share his art with the community. They also bring life to alleyways that might not otherwise get much love. And it's just a really nice way to add some vibrancy and color to maybe some areas that might otherwise be a little neglected. Adding bursts of life to everyday life in downtown De Pere. I think that's what the beauty of, of a mural is, is that it's often, you know, something completely unexpected. Unexpected is the nature of Andrew's designs. You know, for me, it's, it's completely intuitive. I start in, uh, with a basic idea and then I kind of let it turn into what it wants to. His process allows the art to take on a life of its own. At a certain point, I don't feel like I have any ownership of it at all. Um, it's as an artist, I feel more like like it's channeling through me a little bit and, and like with the limited skills that I have, I try to emulate that as, as the best way that I can. The best he can to bring new life to old alleyways. I feel obligated to kind of channel everything that I've experienced and do the best that I can to, to you know, portray that. I enjoy watching people enjoy it, if that makes sense. For Andrew, it's more than just putting paint to wall. My name's Andrew Linskins. I'm an artist, and this is what I was supposed to do. Thanks, Aaron. And you can see more of Andrew's artwork either by taking a walk in downtown De Pere or by following his Instagram page. You can find a link to his profile on our website, wearegreenbay.com. Next week, we'll introduce you to another dedicated member of our community.